already know who it is. It's your girl, your niece, your auntie, your cousin, but I'm not your mama though. That's right. April Praise, aka the coolest teacher in the land. What's going on? We are back in H-Town and I got off the couch because I've been on the couch for the past two weeks because y'all know y'all's cousin Rona came to town and she out here wilding and just shut everything down. Okay, somebody need to tell Rona to sit down, sit down. Teachers, we are in a new time, okay? Because while Rona's out here wilding, we got to teach. We still got to teach. Even though the schools are closed, we still got to teach. So it's virtual teaching now. Now, if you're anything like me, I enjoy this, okay? I really am enjoying, I love technology. And so the fact that I get to really utilize technology to teach the kids, I love it. Some of y'all might not like this and y'all might be upset and overwhelmed. Listen, I'm not gonna be before you long today, amen. Um, we are in a whole new world, okay? A whole new world, a new fantastic point of view. And it might be hard to cope with, but coolest teacher in the land, I got you, okay? Here are th your three diamonds for today. Diamond number one, give yourself grace. This is brand new territory. This is territory a lot of us haven't done before. This is a territory a lot of us haven't seen before. You can't be hard on yourself. You can't expect perfection from something that you've never actually tried to execute. So give yourself grace through this whole learning process because you're doing the best you can. Remember, we don't strive for perfection, we strive for excellence. And what is excellence? Doing the absolute best you can with what you have at that moment. So give yourself grace. Diamond number two, remember your why. Now I know we hear this all year. Remember your why, remember your why. When you're burnt out, remember. Y'all getting tired of hearing remember your why, but let me tell you why it's important. Because if you don't remember why you're teaching, you won't take this seriously. If you won't remember that there are people on the other side of your videos, of, of your assignments that you post who actually need to grow, you won't take this seriously. Now, I know, y'all, I know it's good, okay? We get to teach in our pajamas, essentially. I know. And so when you're in your pajamas, you probably feel a little less motivated than you would in that uh, regular business suit every day. Am I right? I know I'm right. Remember your why when you're planning, when you're trying to execute this stuff. Remember your why and let that why keep you motivated. And number three, the most important diamond, have faith. Have faith. Now, at the beginning of this channel, the first video I ever posted, I told y'all, I'm a little ratchet. I'm real, but what? I'm righteous. Y'all love Jesus. I love Jesus with my whole heart. And it would be a disservice if I didn't come on here and tell you guys to have faith through all this. You know, uh, just yesterday, before the city locked down, I said I wanted to eat some crawfish. Um, I was getting it ordered because I can't, I'm not catching Rona. I'm not fighting y'all's cousin Rona out in these streets. So I said, you know, I'm going to eat it on my patio. It's going to be nice. I ain't ate on my patio in pfft, over a year, like real talk. And so I decided, let me go clean my chairs. Let me go clean my table. And while I was out there cleaning, y'all, I saw two wasp nests. Two wasp nests. I don't do bugs, okay? I don't do bugs. I don't do them, not at all. And so, um, yeah, I started remembering. I was like, okay, how do I get rid of this? You know how y'all like to do? Y'all be spraying bleach on. So y'all be like, yeah, 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 spraying bleach on everything, just messing up paint. Um, 
but I remembered that you're supposed to burn a wasp nest. So I got a, I got like a, a butane torch. And so I was ready to go out there and torch that thing. I was like, Tsh! I was torching them wasp nests, torching them. And, you know, I was doing it like I was stepping back because I thought, you know, they was going to fly out. I'm sitting there like, <laughs> but as I was burning them, y'all, nothing happened. Like nothing came out. It's like everything that was in there was already like removed. There was no wasp eggs or anything else for both of them. And while I was cleaning up, I was like, wow. And in that moment, I heard God say to me, this is an example of what I'm doing right now. You see this virus, you see it's scary, but the problem that you thought was there wasn't there, it was already handled. And this virus, what we're going through, it's already handled. And I just want to encourage you guys with that. I might lose some followers for this, but frankly, y'all, if, if I can't give you this message of faith and hope, then this channel is useless. Okay, throughout everything else I'm teaching you about teacher wellness, my foundation is my faith and my hope, Jesus Christ. And I just want to let you guys know to have faith, keep the faith. He's already handled it. It looks scary. It is scary. You probably deal with anxiety. I've dealt with a lot of anxiety through all this, but my anchor, what's holding me is keeping the faith that he already has it handled. So that's your three diamonds for the day. I hope this encourages you. Uh, be sure to comment. Be sure to give other tips in the comments for working through this virtual teaching time. I know I need some. Like the video, subscribe to the channel, click that ding bell to know when we're posting something and book me, book me. What is that? B-O-O-K, book me. Um, get me flewed out to your school for some professional development. Now, uh, depending on how long y'all's cousin Rona is out here trying to fight folks, uh, book me for some virtual PD, okay? Thank God for the internet. Just opens up new streams of what you can do. Book me for some virtual PD, okay? I would love to connect with you, connect with your school, and just give y'all an encouraging message. Just work with your teachers. And just make y'all live like me, the coolest teacher in the land, baby. All the info below. I'll see y'all later. Coolest teacher in the land. I'm out. Yeah.